Oh, mate, it's well dark, isn't it? <laughs> all right. How you all doing? Hang on. That's really annoying. I can hear a microphone rubbing up against my belly. This is not great ASMR, I'm telling you. Oh, wow. You do not like that, that, that change here. Where's the exposure? Not quite indecent. There we go. <laughs> so, today's going to be a weird one for me. It's call with Zabermall day, or for anyone that's known Zabermall for any period of time, a day with Zabermall. Um, just have a catch up day, man. Just proper chilling out. Um, I've done near enough everything I need to do, and we all need some fucking peace and quiet. I can't go any bolder, and Zaber doesn't want to go bold, so. But, for the last couple of days, Zebra has been messaging me about the idea that he's getting his new PC. He's getting a new PC. Not just I've kind of spoiled it right there. Zebra has got a new PC. He's been running this same Intel Core i7, like 6 or 7 series for a billion to years. They're now on 12, I think, on the 12 series. He's finally upgrading. Some life stuff has happened and it's enabling him to upgrade. He put in the order because he's getting it built rather than him building it himself. Probably a good call, to be fair. All specced up how he likes it for the most part. And uh, we were just in the call. We were just in the call. And a text message comes through. And I'm like, yeah, mate, I bet you that's the PC shop telling you it's ready to pick up. Because mine's supposed to be ready until tomorrow. And, I, uh, and he's like, oh, mate, it is, it is, it is. It's re really is. I said, then turn this fucking call off. Fuck off and go get it, mate. So... Zaber's now getting, he's going to go get his PC. <laughs> now what he's going to do is wait for some pretty monitors to come in stock so that he can hook them up to some, hook up this new machine to uh, to a, a decent set of monitors rather than hooking them up to his old 1080p setup. But if it were me personally, I would have literally fucking hooked the damn thing up. Although actually that would probably tweak my OCD. Not that plugging it into different monitors would have made any difference, but plugged it in and then continued the call while setting up the machine. <laughs> I need to figure out actually what I want to do with Belial because uh, I've got a Windows drive in here that's just forced in here. I've got a games drive that I'm not using because it's, it's, I've not mounted it in Linux and uh, I've got a bunch of files I want to get off the Linux drive to put on another thing, but I can't be asked to do it yet. So, um, yeah. Anyway, <laughs> I'm going to wait for Zabot to come back and then I'm going to get back to my call. Fuck yeah, Zabe's got a new rig. Makes mine look like a baby's toy though. It's two years old. <laughs> it's already like a toy. <laughs> Brand spanking new PC. And the first game you play. Poyo Poyo Tetris. <laughs> oh, in fairness, it was one of the first games I played on Steam Deck too, so... <laughs> It's a good game. It's a really good game. Really fun. <laughs> Jet, you ain't kidding, man. Damn. I think I've been on a call for 12 hours. Which means that... It's... We're bled over again. <laughs> Just lost track of time, man. Poyo Poyo Tetris, games like Poyo Poyo Tetris, are insanely fun, especially when you are playing with friends. Now, should be noted, whilst I have been on call for 12 hours, I have still done all of my other duties that I'm supposed to do throughout the day, so rocking, groovy, However, should extend thanks to the family for allowing me to uh, be on the call and drift around as needed through the day. If you haven't played Poyo Poyo Tetris, I do recommend it. It's Poyo Poyo uh, Tetris 1 and 2. Uh, it's got loads of nifty little game modes in it. It's not just like standard Tetris where you're just dropping down uh, different shapes to make lines and stuff. It's got Tons of other things with like modifiers and speed roads and 
and, and all sorts. And then you've got the Poyo and the Tetris versus modes and, and all that. Really, 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 really fun. Really fun. The wife hopped in. It's a shame Devine's away at the moment because uh, he enjoys the game too. We could have all played a four-player match. I don't think I've ever played a four-player match of that game. But it's, it just is crazy, stupid fun with enough modifiers to keep it entertaining for literally hours. And it's it's pretty cheap too. So it's available on most platforms. I don't think it's cross-play. There's never anyone online. But um, if you've got folks about it, it's pretty fun for Couch Cop. And the online is pretty solid. It's all right. <laughs> um, now, it wasn't literally the first game that Zaber installed on his machine because he hasn't actually set up the machine yet. He's uh, He's got it. He's picked it up. It wasn't supposed to arrive until tomorrow. I don't know. Uh, but he's, he's got it. But he doesn't want to set it up until, uh, until he gets his monitors and stuff. Which is fair. He just doesn't want to gimp it with the old tech. Not that it's gimp in it, but you know, he's going to have to disconnect it and all that anyway. So he's saying he's going to wait until he gets the monitors and all that set up. And then, great. Which will be Sunday or Monday, I think he said. And then he'll let me know how that goes. It's going to be an absolute beast. It does make my machine look kind of old in some areas. Given that he's got, what, um, an Intel 12 Series i7. Uh, was it 12 cores, 20 threads? A weird number. But uh, 12 cores, 20 threads, which uh, puts my machine to uh, shame, which I think I'm on, what, 8 cores, 16 threads? Um, so he, he completely forking curb stomps me on the old proc department raw power there. Um, did he say he's got 32 gigs of RAM? Yeah, 32 gigs of RAM. We all know that maths for RAM is not my strong point. <laughs> um, he's got a 3070. RTX 3070 in it. 3070s have come down in price a lot. I think he's got a really good deal on this PC. I think he spent around about a grand on it. And DeWald linked me one the other day where you can get a 3070 in it for about a thousand as well, 900 to a thousand. Uh, my machine was expensive and it is two years old now, but still far more than I could possibly use. It isn't for now. We'll play the game of can you make it hang when you try and do things to make your PC lock up. <laughs> um, I'm more than capable of doing that. Uh, the downside on my machine actually is that unfortunately I've gone through two graphics cards in two years, like every single year for the last couple of years, I've burnt out a graphics card every year or caused one to fail for whatever reason. So, and we don't factor that into the overall cost of my machine, but it was fucking expensive. Uh, uh, I'm glad that Zaber got a new PC because we, we all said, me, Ram, and Zaber said, we ain't buying new computers. We just ain't going to. And then over the last couple of years, we just said, fuck it, just one last hurrah. We bought the new machines. I think Ram's the next to get his. I didn't expect Zaber to get his for the next couple of months. When Ram gets his, that'd be fantastic. Um, I will then end up with the slowest machine in the group again. <laughs> in every area other than graphics card, I think. Um... Yeah, now we can actually all play some fucking games. <sighs> I'm not going to go crash out. <laughs> Legit though, Puyo Puyo Tetris is a great, great, great fun. Great fun. Um, party games, puzzle games, couch co-op games. Can't go wrong. Can't go wrong. It's been a brilliant catch up. But I am fucking beat, man. So I hope you're well. I'll see you all. With a bit of luck in the next one. I'm too old for this shit. <laughs>